Okay, here's the little troublemaker. I want to warn you guys, when, you, when you're listening to this um, Costco haul, it's going to be, there's going to be a lot of loud screaming. I took him with us to Costco. He stayed in the car with my husband while I shopped. Oh, don't go downstairs. Anyway, and then so I brought him home, and so I could do the groceries, I went ahead and um, put him in his playpen, and he protested loudly through the whole entire time, screamed and screamed. If I knew how to do a voice voiceover, I would. He doesn't scream like that usually. He's just like a toddler. Mom's busy. I'm going to make the biggest fuss. I know how. So anyway, turn it down. Don't listen to it. I am very, very sorry you have to listen to him screaming while I was doing this. He's a good boy. I don't know what got into him. <laughs> good morning. It's Sunday. I'm getting ready to go to Costco, and I just wanted to show you my little bitty post office here. It's so tiny here in Olala. These are rhododendron bushes. See, mine are purple and these are more of a whitish lavender. Anyway, you got your one mailbox here. And then in the first set of doors. And here's where I have my post office box. People put their magazines here that they don't want to keep, you know, or their flyers or whatever. And mine's over there. And that is it. That is every post office box in this place. I love it. Somebody lost their kitty cat. Recycle, please. And in here is locked, of course, because it's Sunday, but it's open when the regular post office stays. Well, I didn't know this. Is it the president? Yep. I never saw this. This building is dedicated to public service, 1990. George Bush, President of the United States, by Anthony M. Frank, Postmaster General. You got a little doorbell if you need anybody. <laughs> I'm always tickled by little towns. Bye, see you at Costco. The plant section is getting a lot smaller, but these are cute. That's a lot better price than I paid at the grocery store. So, these are $13.99 and is that a smaller bag than it used to be? I think it is. I'm getting this for my mom and dropping it off. I already have two. 900 of these should keep me in business. It takes a lot less time with these than it does um, like a Kleenex to remove nail polish. It's like magic. There's this. That looks like a good price. Okay, I'm sorry about this. I'm rocking. Cheesy macaroni, chicken noodle soup, creamy pasta vegetables, beverage servings, milk and orange drink. Hmm. That's a good deal, I bet. I've been seeing these and wondering, do we need them? I think we do. So, French macarons. That's a way better deal than I got last time I bought them. Okay, I'm home. And here's an overview, kind of an overview. Um, I'll show you each thing except the thing that I got for my husband for Father's Day. Um, that's going to be still secret until next Sunday. <laughs> so this was um, $14.99, but it had a $3 off on it. And I really needed a hat like this. I didn't have anything for my head. <sighs> 50 I was hoping it was better than that, but it's better than nothing, you know. I, I guess I could put a 
what do you call those, like a handkerchief, like up inside of here, or a, or a towel even, and it would get some of the, I've got lupus and sun really, really is hard on my skin. The top of my head to the bottom of my feet, sun is not good for me. I have to get my vitamin D in other ways. I showed these, oh my God, you know, he went with us in the Costco. He stayed with my husband and the other two poodles in the car. When we got home, we let him go potty out in the yard and run and play. And then I brought him in and I put him back in his playpen while I try to do this. Well, he is in there having a righteous fit, if you can hear him. <laughs> anyway, I showed you these cotton rounds while I was in there. And I thought they were a good deal. I got nine of them and this will last me probably a year. Well, maybe at least nine months. This is my last non-food item, and it is um, the scents that I couldn't find in the grocery stores. I was so happy. There's, um, there's mint, rose, this is the one I really wanted, fresh cut grass, and what is this one? Lilac. So, my husband doesn't care for scented soaps at all. I will probably wait till he goes back out to sea to put these out, and that's fine with me. Okay, now we're going to go and look at the other things that I got here. I am going to put the prices of things in the, um, you know, description below so that you'll know what I spent on everything. Um, because I'm trying to do this fast to get back to that puppy. He needs out of that playpen. Um, so, that'll be below, like I said. So, I got two of these. One will go somewhere else and one will stay here. I got two of the great big boom chicka pops. Love, love, love those. And you can't get the big bags anywhere else here than um, at uh, Costco. I got one of these, but I'm not going to keep it. It's also going to go somewhere else. Um, I'm not saying where just yet. We are a mayonnaise loving family, so I got both of these, and I bet this will just last to the end of the summer, and I'll have to get two more big ones for autumn, but we're about out, so that was a good find. And then I got some of these Hippies Organic Chickpea. Um, I like these a lot. I've heard some people, it, it, I think that you either love these or you really, really don't. I love these. Oh, mercy, somebody come buy this puppy. <laughs> I'm hurrying as fast as I can. This is what I got for baking. This is the first time that I haven't bought the um, Nestle uh, brand. I've been a stickler for that. But I'm dropping my, um, you know, my, the way I did things. I'm just going to go with the, what I can afford. And so this is going to last me for Christmas, I hope. I think it will. And the pecans are more for less, as far as I can tell. This is not the size bag that they used to be in, as far as I remember. This is two pounds. Were they always two pounds? I wanted to get walnuts, too, but I wasn't about to, because one little bag was $13.99, I think. It was expensive. Speaking of nuts, hide that, because it got eaten. And there's another one right there, but it's all cashews. So those are going to go in a hidey hole. I was so proud of myself for buying this salad. It's like a meat, cheese, tortellinis, and, you know. Anyway, it was $3 off. Well, it ought to be, because it's $15.76. Oh, my word. Anyway, I'm marveling at all the prices. I'm going to do this as fast as I can, guys. got the great big string cheese. I'll put that in the refrigerators for now. I got the different uh, types of, you know, the variety pack of sandwiches, Swiss, Colby Back, Colby Jack, Cheddar, and Monterey Jack. This is the only meat I bought. There's four in here. Vegetables, I got cocktail cucumbers, gala apples, and an organic avocado ranch chopped kit salad. The only bread I got was a container of naan, and I think we're coming to the last step here. Got a big coffee in the medium. Guess it's good. I didn't even look. 
minced garlic and Skippy peanut butter. I am so sorry about that dog, you guys. I'm going to go get him out now.